The second wave hit in a way that no one really anticipated. What we're seeing is, is the desperation out there in the hospitals. Um, we're seeing desperation in the communities. At the same time, you know, we've seen communities come together. We've seen how community groups have started uh, places where people can go in and, and access oxygen if they need. Uh, a group of young doctors, Doctors for You, they call themselves, DFY, they have set up centers where they run oxygen therapy. Hotels have been converted into, into oxygen wards for people who need that to be able to breathe properly. So it's, it's amazing what is happening. And um, I think it's, it's really about how do we all together ride this wave, uh, ride it in a way that uh, we also learn where the cracks in the system are and how do we make it stronger and more resilient?